mentor explains. Superior mentor demonstrates. Whereas the greatest mentor inspires. They'll tell you to have hope in yourself that you can do much better. In our life, all of us will, will have mentors in the form of you know, friends, family members, well wishes, or it could be teachers or bosses, you know. And we see role models in some of them. Mentoring requires role models. Role models. And movies have been a source of inspiration for all of us. And you see mentoring as a popular theme in movies. So today, because I'm giving this speech, I took some liberty to choose certain movies that I like, uh, which have inspired me, and also which portrays the principles of Toastmaster mentoring. First up is the Karate Kid. So you, you look at the scene here. So what Mr. Han, who is um, the mentor here, and the kid, he makes that kid, it's, it's, it's a very popular jacket scene, where he has to take out the jacket from the hook, put it on, drop it down, again put it back on the hook. And he has to do this thousand times. And he does this whole day, and you can imagine the level of frustration that kid would have had. Here Mr. Han goes beyond you know, karate to teach the lessons of life, the basic lessons of life. So why he does that is because during this process he's make sure, making sure that he doesn't go back and throw his jacket, he always keeps it on the book. Also in the process he teaches him a particular step in the karate, probably you know, something like this. So here he clearly demonstrates experience and knowledge. So through its wisdom, Mr. Han knows what exactly to be taught and what to be made by the student to learn by himself. So there is a clear demonstration of experience and knowledge. So next up is one of my um, favorite superhero movie, movies, which is X-Men. So here, Professor um, Charles, he takes certain mutants, trains them to and also nurtures their talents. So during this process, he's very respectful and caring for them. The reason being that so mutants, because they are different from you know people who are in the social setup, they are always disregarded. And also he believes that if you have power, the use and misuse of it is everything. So it's important to show the path which helps, you know people to use their talent in a right way. So here he clearly demonstrates being respectful and caring. Next up is one of the you know, famous uh, animated movies. Here, Panda, which is Fu. So he wants to learn Kung Fu and he wants to master Kung Fu. He always um, you know, treats the, the people who know Kung Fu as, as gods. But when he gets an opportunity to learn or to become master himself, um, he goes to you know master Shifu and he gives regimen very rigorous training uh, regime and he goes through it. But still he fails to get the basics of um, kung fu. And he go desperately goes to the master and says that no no I cannot do this it's it's impossible it's not my cup of tea and things like that. So because master is more committed, so he makes sure that he learns. And he becomes, you know, who becomes a master of it. And we know, you know, what happens in the movie. So he, here, you know, master is demonstrating the qualities like being committed and dependable. With this, my fellow Toastmasters, Toastmasters has a history of nurturing and providing guidance through mentoring. As Toastmasters and Toastmaster mentors, we need to imbibe this characteristics like you know, sharing experience and knowledge, being more respectful and caring, and being more committed and dependable. So, so that is what makes uh, the whole Toastmaster mentoring a very successful experience for each of us. And I don't want to leave this um, stage without thanking um, Sagar and Anmol. Um, I couldn't get a good picture of uh, Sagar, uh, though, so... 
Um, so they have been my mentors uh, for uh, you know all my Toastmaster uh, speeches. Uh, they helped me a lot. Uh, they are very meticulous in um, uh, in reviewing or giving the feedback, and also making sure that I incorporate the feedback um, that they have given. It was a wonderful experience. So again, it's not there in the organization today. Uh, Anmol is not here, uh, but it was a very indeed a fulfilling experience to have um, them as my uh, mentors. Uh, as people say, as you know, there is there is a saying. People forget what you did, people you know, forget how you did it, but people will never forget how you have been made, made to feel. Right? So they made me feel that I could do better, much better than what you know, I could uh, probably do and they have brought the best in me. So I am very thankful and, and as part of this forum I would request all of you to take up the mentorship opportunities as much as possible because there is a benefit, more benefit to the mentor than the mentee. So one, because you will give opportunities for others to thank you. And the second, in the process, you will learn much more um, than them in accomplishing in your goals. Thank you. Thank you so much.